Zendaya effortlessly took on the role of Sally the seashell seller in the Edgar Wright-directed Squarespace Super Bowl advert, released on Wednesday. The actress, 25, was in her element while wearing a variety of whimsical outfits in the new commercial, in which she transforms from a down-on-her-luck shell seller to the owner of a successful seashell emporium. Augusts Andre 3000 narrates the minute long ad and even makes a brief appearance as he reels off tongue-twisting sentences that take inspiration from the alliteration-heavy rhyme. Of the quirky role, Zendaya told Pitchfork, I was incredibly excited to have the opportunity to work and create with Edgar Wright on a story narrated by Andre 3000 Benjamin. Super Bowl 56 will take place at the SoFi Stadium in Inglewood, California on February 13th. Dr. Dre, Snoop Dogg, Eminem, Mary J. Blige, and Kendrick Lamar are headlining the halftime show. It comes after Zendaya defended her hit HBO series Euphoria after the Drug Abuse Resistance Education DARE, organization condemned the series. DARE released a statement in late January where they called out Euphoria for choosing to misguidedly glorify and erroneously depict high school student drug use, addiction, anonymous sex, violence, and other destructive behaviors as common and widespread in today's world. The actress responded to DARES statement with one of her own in an interview with Entertainment Weekly, revealing their show is not a moral tale. Our show is in no way a moral tale to teach people how to live their life or what they should be doing, the actress began. If anything, the feeling behind euphoria, or whatever we have always been trying to do with it, is to hopefully help people feel a little bit less alone in their experience and their pain, Zendaya added. And maybe feel like they're not the only one going through or dealing with what they're dealing with, she continued. DARES statement added. It is unfortunate that HBO, social media, television program reviewers, and paid advertising have chosen to refer to the show as groundbreaking, rather than recognizing the potential negative consequences on school-age children who today face unparalleled risks and mental health challenges. They added that the organization would welcome the opportunity for their team, including their high school-aged youth advocacy board, to meet with individuals at HBO who are involved with producing Euphoria to present our concerns directly.